Hello. In this video, I will be talking about how to use the cut extrude feature in Autodesk Inventor 2012. I'll be creating the part shown here in this drawing. To start off, there are several different methods that you can use to create this part. The first method would be how a machinist would do it. You would start off with a solid block and then cut away these slots that are shown here in this block. Another way to do this would be to start off with a pre-cut block or having a side cut off or one of the slots cut off beforehand. You would start off with either the bottom left or the bottom right sketch and from there you would move on to create, create the second sketch and extrude that to create the second slot. I'll be using the second method. As you can see I have already created the first sketch. This sketch is made to the dimensions shown in the bottom left right here. After creating the first sketch, you would extrude the part to the correct dimensions, and then you would have to create the second slot. There are two surfaces on which you can create a new sketch from here. You can either use the top surface or this right hand side surface. For this, I will use the right surface. After selecting the surface and creating a new sketch, you will have to create a box where the outline of what you want to cut out is shown. I want to make a slot that is one inch wide. After specifying that, you would also want to specify how far away it is from each of the edges. After doing so, you would extrude and select the, that box like normal, except instead of choosing the extrude feet, the extrude, you would choose the extrude cut, which is a button shown here in the extrude toolbar. It's right below the extrude button, and instead of extruding, it cuts into the piece. You can choose the distance you want to extrude, or you can select an extent. For this, I will choose all. What this means is no matter how the dimensions of the original block changes, this cut will always extend from this surface till the end of the piece. After doing so, I have now completed this drawing. Thank you for watching.